Sites, back with another Madness Answers and another question. Now, this one has to do with race. So I'm sure we're going to have a few comments that are normal. And then from there, a bunch of racist bullshit afterwards. But she wants her question answered. So Tyrone Magnus is going to answer it. Now listen to what she wrote me. I actually may answer some of this as I go along reading it. Alright. says, hi Tyrone. I have a question for you. And my question is, do you think black men lower their standards for other races? I'm going to personally say no. I don't believe that. But let's keep going here. I feel like black men do, especially the ones in the media. I feel like society, including black men, value non-black women more than black women. So when black men uh, get with non-black women, they feel like they're sort of getting a prize. If a successful black man gets with a black woman, he has to evaluate us from our background, financially, economically, demographically, and if we have kids or not. But when it comes to a non-black woman, the bitch could be a stripper, gold digger, opportunist, uh, fame whore, groupie who sucked the right dick to get noticed, and black men will still tote that bitch around like she's the best thing since sliced bread. <laughs> ah, if you look at black men in the media uh, as examples, you will see the non-black men, the non-black women that they are dealing with are not wifey material. A lot of times, um, examples, uh, Kim K, Amber Rose, Coco, Kendra, etc. Uh, these women have been passed around from celebrity to celebrity, have done scandalous things to get to the level that they are. What do you think about this? Do you think that black men lower their standards for other races? As a whole, I do not believe that most black men, when they date out of um, you know, their race, I do not believe that they lower their standards. But you do have some points. These women here that these celebrities are dating, um, just these few here though that, that that you named. It's not the majority. Yeah, they 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 done did what they had to do to to get the fame. You got what I'm saying? They're very attractive women, first and foremost, because if they were ugly, beastly girls, they would they no way they would have the fame that they have. Kim K looks good, Amber Rose look good, and so on. Okay, now. Um, I don't believe that, see here's the thing, you said that when a successful black man gets with a black woman that he has to evaluate, you know, all these things about you. But then if you were to take a non-black woman, he's just going to go pick her up like, hey, hey, oh, she used to be a stripper, so what, Nick? You know what I mean? Nah, that's not true. That's not true. Only 9% of black people, period date outside of their race. Nine is just blown the fuck up because of, you know, the celebrities that do it. They are in the spotlight. So people can make a big deal about this. I saw this one brother speak and he, he rattled off like 20 or more black celebrity men who dated outside their race. Now this gets into the whole conspiracy theory area, but he was speaking about these men not being able to make it to a pinnacle status without marrying a white woman. So he feels as though they sold out to be accepted more by Hollywood in order to get the parts that they need to get to a celebrity status. That's a different video. But, um, I mean, you, you do have some points. I do believe there are some dudes out there that are like, you know, well, you know, any white bitch is better than a black, black bitch. You know, I'm, I'm sure there are guys like that. I'm not like that. The majority of all the brothers that I've met that, will, that have dated outside of the race or are thinking of dating outside their race actually just want to try uh, a white woman... Asian woman, Spanish woman, whatever it is. Speaking of Spanish, I got a Puerto Rican homeboy who won't date Puerto Rican women. And the reason why he won't is because she said 
he hates the Puerto Rican woman's attitude. <laughs> so as you can see, he's not saying white women are better. He just feels as though they have an easygoing attitude. It's funny too, because if you know his wife, she has a very easygoing attitude. Not that all black women have a bad attitude, but you know, y'all tend to have a harder exterior because y'all been dealt with more. Like Sarah, a lot of people think that, um, you know, I'm with Sarah because Sarah lets me run over her. Eh, eh. First of all, um, Sarah, if you want to say, she got the attitude of a black woman and she twice as loud. So please, nobody, after y'all watch this fucking video, don't tell me I'm with her because she let, she's a doormat. She lets me walk all over because it ain't like that. She went to all black church when I first met her and everything. So it's like, you know, it ain't, no, she, she just happens to be white. Okay, as far as I'm concerned. I'm not saying she's a black woman in disguise, but for all those things that black women say that we date white women for, that ain't it, okay? Oh, uh, you know, cause she's just as supportive as a black woman would be. If I got locked up, I don't know if she would wait for me for nine years ago. But anyway, um, yeah, you know, she, she got good credit. I'll tell you that, you know, maybe that's a stereotypical white thing. But that's about it. Her family crazy. It ain't like her family's like, you know, you know, some hair type of, how are you, sir? Jeeves parked the Mercedes and then take Master Crawley's coat. You know, it ain't like she's from that type of family. You know what I'm saying? So, um, yeah, that's it. I do not think that most black men that date outside of their race just take anything white. No. Some of them do, yes. And those in celebrity status, see, you got to remember, these girls that do all this, that are with the celebrities, all you got to do is act a fool to get some, get some attention. You know, Amber Rose was a stripper, Coco, I think she, I think Coco was a, um, was a swimsuit model, though. And like, maybe a video model. I don't think she did any whore shit, you know what I mean? Uh, yeah, I mean, Kim K, I mean, I don't know if they released the tape, but not on their own. If they didn't, then you can't call her a hoe because plenty of us have made our own videotapes. But the fact that she made it with Ray J took her to that stash. I mean, you know, you look at uh, Paris Hilton, although I don't think she fucks with anybody that's not black. I mean, that's not white. Um, same thing. I don't know how her shit got out, but you know, celebrities, all of a sudden, you know, all these sex tapes just keep coming the fuck out, right? All right, that's all I got to say. Um, I don't believe that all black men do that, but do a minuscule amount, yes. But don't let that swerve your opinion of black men that date outside of their race, okay? That's all I'm saying, saying, because look, not just say Satan, <laughs> that's all I'm saying. <laughs> um, you can see a black dude walking down the street with an ugly white girl, and you're going to say, look, he just take anything white. But what if you see him walking down the street with an ugly black girl? You're going to say, oh, he can do better than that. And you like your opinion changes. You know what I'm saying? All right, I'm done ram rambling on about this shit. If I missed anything, put it in the uh, comments, and I'll answer that shit separately. Talk to y'all later.